Hi loves, it's Kat. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I want to share something I find very exciting with you. I placed my very first order with Cezanne and I could not be more excited to unbox it with you today. So I thought we could do it together, do a little first impressions, see what we think of the pieces. Um, Cezanne is a brand that I have always looked up to, been inspired by. I really love that French girl aesthetic, the je ne sais quoi that it has. So I'm really excited to try the brand and honestly I don't know why it's taken me so long to pull the trigger, but I'm very excited to have finally done it. For those who don't know, Cezanne is a popular French brand, popular over there as well as here. They make beautiful knits, gorgeous, stunning blouses, and just really quality pieces that should last you a lifetime. Or at least that's what they say. So we'll find out together how things are looking, but I'm super excited to share this with you and to finally place my order. Um, I visited France earlier this year, which was incredible, and unfortunately we ran out of time and I wasn't able to go into the Cezanne store in Paris, which broke my heart. Still on the bucket list, hopefully someday, but for now I have finally placed the order, so let's get into it. So here is the package. Right off the bat, the packaging is just beautiful and is already giving me the nostalgia of Paris. It's so beautifully done. Um, I, I just love it. I just love it. I don't even want to open it, but I'm going to. <laughs> oh, wow. They've got a little note on the inside box. The French way to say, thank you for welcoming us into your lives and writing the story of Cezanne by our side. Oh my gosh, how beautiful and thoughtful. I mean, it's really just, I'll try to show you. So there, they kind of give a little note on the inside flap. And then here, without things moving around too much, it's inside the box. Beautiful packaging. I mean, it's just, it's really such an experience. And now having been to France, especially Paris, it, it, it almost takes me back there a little bit. It's, it's really lovely. Okay, so let's see. gently open this. So I ordered a blouse and a cardigan to start off my collection with them, hopefully. I just slide those out. Oh, yes. And I'll be sure to link these down below in case you're interested in them as well. But I believe this was called the Rin, Rim Shirt, R-Y-M-N, I want to say. Again, I'll link it down below. But this blouse is even more beautiful in real life. I don't know that the camera is doing it justice. It has these amazing beautiful cutout details. Oh my gosh, and just the fabric. It's such a soft, beautiful cotton. So lightweight, which is excellent for where I live in the desert. Here, I'm gonna try to give you a close up of this stunning, stunning blouse. So if you look closely, see all that, all that work, it's not, the name's escaping me now. It's not embroidery, but the way it's done is just so beautiful. And the sleeves, of course, also have the cutouts running through it as well. And then one of my favorite parts about this blouse is actually the cuffs of the sleeve. Do you see that? Just really gorgeous. I mean, no detail left unturned. It's so thoughtfully and beautifully done. I cannot wait to try this on. Um, I also love the collar too. It's got some kind of like the, the cuffs, those cutouts. Just beautiful. And then the back is solid. So yes, 
cannot wait to try this stunning blouse on. Okay, let's check out the sweater. Okay, so I have started to have a minor obsession with red, and I really wanted a, a pop of color to add to my wardrobe, you know, just wearing with blue jeans or a black satin slip skirt. I just wanted a fun color pop, and what better way to do that than with a beautiful French red cardigan. This is stunning. The quality, again, is just wow. Just wow. I really, really love these buttons too. These are so much better. In real life, oh my gosh. Now, in full honesty, I have been torn on getting this cardigan. I have really, really wanted it because I love the look and I love the classicness of it, but I have heard some people say that the fabric is quite itchy, so I've been a little nervous to do that. So. I'll try it on and let you know what I think, but so far just holding it, you definitely feel it, but it doesn't feel like the worst. But of course, my hands are a lot different than uh, the rest of my body. So we'll see, we'll have to try that out. But one of my favorite things about this piece, which they show you on the website, and if you are a longtime Cezanne fan, then I'm sure you already know, but the versatility of this piece is just incredible. So you can wear it like this with the buttons in the front as a crew neck sweater. You can also wear it with the buttons in the back as a crew neck sweater. And they specifically put the back tag more to the side of the neck so that you could do that without it bothering you. Or you can of course wear it like a classic cardigan. So I guess let's try these pieces on. Okay, we'll start with the cardigan. Just need to unbutton it here. I really like how they also put this like gross grain, gross grain. I'm sure I'm not pronouncing that correctly, but it's that type of ribbon, gross, gross grain, grease grain, someone can correct me in the comments, but it just reinforces it and gives the sweater more stability as well as the buttons. So love that detail. Let's see here. Okay. Here we go. I do have a long sleeve shirt on, so I probably need to take it off to get a real sense for the feel of it. Okay, but right off the bat, the fit is right there. This is a size small, which I would say is my typical size. I'm 5'3 and a bit more on the petite side of things. I feel like if I wanted it to be tight or really fitted, I could have done an extra small, but I kind of like that it's... Okay, she's cute. Definitely gives that dramatic pop I was looking for. I feel like too, you could even, just to make it a little more interesting, you could do the top button. Okay, so I've now tried it on as a full on sweater with the blue jeans. And you know what, maybe, maybe I should go down a, a size because when I tucked it in, it just seemed too voluminous. I'll show you that in a second. Um, this is how it looks untucked, just with some regular straight leg blue jeans. I will say it's a little scratchy. It's not the worst, but it's definitely not the coziest or the softest. Um, I don't know that that's necessarily a deal breaker for me. I really am only feeling it in the arms. Um, my chest and back are okay. So we'll see, but let me show you how this looks tucked in. Okay, and this is how it looks tucked in. So I'm just, I'm a little concerned that maybe there's a little too much 
fabric for tucking, but maybe it's not the worst. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. Um, if I should go a size down or if we think it's fine as is. I do love the color though, especially with the blue jeans. Perfect pop of red. Obsessed. Okay, the blouse, I am in love. It is absolute perfection. It looks so good on. This is it untucked with a few buttons undone. Um, it's also really incredibly soft and breathable. I've just, this might be the most beautiful shirt, certainly that I own, possibly that I've ever even worn. I, I am just so in love. Let me tuck it in. I'll be right back. Oh my gosh, yes, it is making all my French girl dreams come true. It is everything and more. It's just, it's perfect. It's absolutely perfect. It's comfortable. The size is spot on. Like I said, I'm normally a small and this is a size uh, 36 French. Let me see if I can get a little closer. You can kind of see all that beautiful detail. Also, I have a few buttons undone to show the necklace, but you could also button it all the way up um, for work or if that's just the vibe you're going for. And that looks stunning and exquisite as well. Absolutely beautiful. Just such a, a fantastic piece. I am over the moon. I could not be happier. Absolutely love it. And before I go, I want to add one other thing that I didn't touch on when I was first unboxing my order because I was so excited to just look at the pieces, but with every Saison order, and this is something I had heard but didn't know for sure, they usually send you a little something extra, which I think is just such a wonderful and beautiful touch. Uh, it, makes, it makes you feel... I don't know, a little more connected to the brand. It's more like a friend than just a company. So I think that's a wonderful touch. Um, so I wanted to share with you what they included in mine. Uh, the first thing is this super cute canvas tote. Oh my gosh, it says Bonjour Phoenix. How cute. Oh my gosh, does this mean they're gonna bring a Cezanne Boutique to Phoenix? <sighs> One can dream. I really hope they do, but this is so cute. I will definitely be using this. And then it's just plain on the back. But who doesn't need a good canvas tote? Thank you, Cezanne. Okay, and then also, I am not sure what this is. And my French, unfortunately, is terrible. But here is how it looks. And we can open it together. The back is equally as cute with a beautiful little ribbon bow. Okay, what is this? goodness. <laughs> oh, is it a bandana? Scarf? Oh my goodness, it's beautiful. Oh, I am in love. Oh, thank you, Cezanne. What an incredible bonus gift. Oh, I love it. The color and the pattern. It's these beautiful, almost fallish florals. They're red and purple with a touch of gold. Oh, so pretty. Oh my gosh, I cannot wait to wear this. Right now I'm thinking probably in my hair. That could be kind of cute. You could also do it around my neck, but like, I'm just doing this very quickly, but like a ponytail. Like a ponytail, like that. Very cute. Could also do something around the neck. Absolutely love this. This is beautiful. Thank you so much, Cezanne. Oh my gosh. Can you tell I'm really enjoying this? <laughs> All right, well, thanks so much for joining me for this little unboxing of my first Cezanne order. Let me know in the comments what you thought of the pieces. And let me know too, do you shop at Cezanne? Do you have any of their pieces? Do you love them, like them? How do we feel about the brand? 
So far, I'm personally falling in love. Again, I love that French girl aesthetic and I think they nail it so good and I'm excited to try more of their pieces. So thank you so much for watching and I'll see you again real soon. Bye.